tie us to the, the mirror side and then reroll the item room and, you know, all that good stuff. Because as much as I would like Abel, uh, I only really ever take him when I, when he's like my last conjoint piece. Oh, whoops. Pat finger the E button. I broke the mirror. Wait a second. I'm surprised I didn't die instantly. I thought you died instantly if you broke the mirror. Um, I guess I should pay more attention when I put my fingers back on the keyboard. <laughs> That's a blooper. That one's staying in. I am so clutch, dude. Okay. Ah! You're kidding, right? Oh no. So I guess I'm thankful. Whoa, this guy had a lot of velocity to his... I am... I am defeated. I am defeated. I've been getting shellacked. I've been getting my fucking ass kicked. I'm sorry for swearing in the first 10 seconds of the video, YouTube, I'm sorry. Uh, but I, I just... I, I've been having a bad day in Isaac for some reason. I've just been playing extraordinarily poorly. So I think I need a break from the Lost Runs. I, as, as sorry as I have to, I am to say it, you saw it for yourself. It, it's just been, it's a damn disaster. It's, it's a massacre. <laughs> Bros, I'm, I'm gonna just need something to calm down. So we're playing as Isaac. Health down, that's just insult, bad trip too. At least I got the tears out, out of it. Th this run apparently does not wish to be the one, huh? Yeah, okay, there goes the tears aura. I'm about to die. <laughs> I mean, what's wrong with me, man? Why am I so shit today? Why am I so shit at the game today? Am I like, I'm not tired. I slept well last night. I got the damage aura at least, thank God. Oh, thank God for some HP too. I don't know, what's wrong with me, man? There's just some, something's gone horribly wrong and like my brain is not calibrated right today, apparently. It's not calibrated right to play Isaac. <laughs> some, something's, something's horribly off. Oh, I do want Tarot Cloth. I also want Bogo Bombs. Ah, uh, fuck it. I'm sorry, Donation Machine. Tarot Cloth is huge. Uh, what do I get? A full card? Okay, I'm pretty sure Tarot Cloth full card does nothing. Alt Path, here we come. I gotta still be careful, man. I only got one heart. I, I gotta be a bit careful. What do we got in here, though? Emopsis? Come on, roll me. Bloody lust. Yeah, that's worth it. I've been taking so much damn damage. <laughs> I've been so bad at the game. Uh, why not take an item that rewards you for being bad? Yeah, it seems like a good idea, right? Alternatively, I also have an item that rewards me for not being bad, aka purity. So, really, I gotta gotta pick my poisons here. Found soul is an incredible trinket. Okay, uh, that's gonna help quite a bit against uh, Clostomia here specifically. I'm gonna go angels, obviously. I mean, who do you take me for? I can't re-roll you, so I'm gonna pray that the pills are good. Sucks. Whatever. Health down. <laughs> Man. <laughs> Man. <laughs> Bros, I don't know how I feel about this run right now. It's going pretty well. It's almost like I'm not a character that will die on the first floor if I skill issue a little bit. And that's that's nice. It, also, I've just been playing kind of, kind of well. I, not to toot my own horn too much, but so far on this run, I've been playing okay. That's fine to take. Polydactyly is good. Oh yeah. Hangman. Sure. It's gonna be a lot of money. Yeah, there goes my lost soul and my deal chance as well. But to be fair, that one I wasn't too bank uh, too much banking on anyway. As per usual, you know, it's the 33% chance anyway, so I wasn't really expecting it to happen. I got the damage aura back as well, which is tremendous. I love that. Let's peep the shop, brother. I got a ton of cash. The cash flow is looking nice. Unfortunately, the shop is not. Hello there. I have greed, huh? Unfortunately, I have the ability to reroll a lot on this floor next to the mirror site. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I can already see the comments. I know, I know, but... Look, if it wasn't in the secret room pool, I would pick it up more. But <laughs> it's in the secret room. I need to reroll it. I'm sorry. Please. What's it with Keeper's Kin, man? You obviously wouldn't know this, but... I say I'm not fighting for this. I'm using the st my precious stars card just to just stop myself from doing... Just, just dying in there horribly. Uh, you wouldn't know this, but in most of the runs I did earlier today, if I ever happened to be able to reroll in a secret room, Keeper's Kin would always show up, man. I don't know what it is with that item. I don't know why it's, like, so insistent on showing up. I guess rocks can just randomly spawn spiders, so I guess Keeper's Kin isn't all terrible. For some reason, I thought it literally only spawns spiders when you blow up rocks. Obviously, that's where you get the majority of them from, but I guess it can still spawn them even just naturally, just randomly, so... It's just occasional spiders. That's good. They, they're chunking, they're chunking blub, for instance. So, can't really complain. Well, it's not like I can re-roll you. Man, what's with all the money on this run? Ah, come on. Ah, come on. Ah, come on! I could have used it once. I don't even wanna. Friend Finder's just gonna mind flood the hell out of me. I 
really want to see my angel on this floor. I want to see my, my beloved, my angel. Okay, well, actually, there's only one angel in my life, but I guess I can make space for another. If the game would like... Would like to give me one. Uh, also, what the heck is going on? I got hit three times in that room. Bloody less is going huge. <laughs> I don't even need purity anymore. Oh, man. Uh, that's Gideon, too. I'm... I'm not getting the angel deal on this one because I got hit again. Oh, man. My life's a damn disaster. My life's a damn nightmare. Box. No. Yes, candle is great. Oh, and it's not Gideon. It's not Gideon. Can you believe it? It is not Gideon. It doesn't matter because I got hit anyway, but gotcha now. Gotcha now, bitch. I got it? I uh, was going to be upset that I don't have a roll, but honestly, yeah, Holy Light is good, so it doesn't even matter. All right, this run is going going nicely now. <laughs> There's, there is something happening here, all right? I guess I have to take this. It's not like I get another roll. Oh, yeah, my found soul is back. Let's go, my my beloved, my friend, the found soul. Yeah, with the higher tier rate and stuff, we're kind of shredding, dude. Gotta use my charges efficiently, right? Oh, that's great. That's a great item. Yes. Oh, we're coming around to it. Oh, yeah, lost found souls tiers are also going to be... Uh, do they get their own tractor beam? Hold on. They do. Okay, they're not gonna like converge with mine, but that's fine because like we're gonna be stacked most of the time anyway, and then <laughs> then it goes kinda nuts. What's in my shop? Mama Mega. Mama Mega. Sure. Screw it. Well, that's unfortunate. <laughs> there goes Found Soul. Bound to happen, I guess. Roll me. Give me this. It's good! It's good! It's just good. Alright, boss. Pile, you are Omega dead. There was nothing you could be doing, man. Huge. Uh, I still got Angel Precedent. I've already taken... Yeah, I might as well walk in here. Okay. Well, no items means nothing to lose. Anyway, considering I'm finally out of prison, I have like a decent run going. I can just actually banter now. <laughs> yes, I think I think I'm... Here's a bit I've been workshopping for a while. Namely, it is like something that I, why I just want to ask like, am I the only one that does this? Am I the only one that experiences this behavior? I'd like to think I probably am not very this is not very common i like to assume that i am pretty antisocial and i'm kind of antisocial like i prefer avoiding social interactions more than i you know want to do them <clears throat> but i think that's like a classic like millennial slash zoomer thing as well right everybody knows the joke of uh i've been spending the past four hours preparing and dreading for a phone call right that type of that type of deal what i mean is let me let me exemplify this what i what i what i mean specifically is how i go out of my way to show offline on pretty much every like every interactable place namely discord right i'm always just show offline on discord i've been like that for like five plus years now and there's uh, there's a multitude of reasons why the main one being i just like kind of don't want to get randomly messaged by people for the most part if i'm friends with somebody and they message me like or much rather like they know that i always show up as offline so they know they can still message me and get a response right but the good thing about showing offline is especially when somebody doesn't know you as well they're not incentivized or inclined to just message you for like random stuff that like you don't really care for that you wouldn't want to carry a conversation for because they think you're offline and they're not going to get an immediate response right like this is the thing that like the modern internet culture has created because everybody is always online or at least like we just assume everybody's always online we just assume that everybody's immediately responsive so that whenever you send somebody a message they will be able to respond very quickly i think that's asinine i don't think that's how you should treat it what you should be doing is treating every message you send to somebody like an email. You should never expect an immediate response. You should always expect that it will take up to a week for them to respond. Maybe depending on the medium, you know, if you can see that they've responded, let Rex seen it or whatever, maybe at that point you should probably expect them to respond once they've seen it. Yeah, that's a, that is toxic. What I'm doing isn't toxic because I'm showing it as offline. People don't know if I'm just genuinely offline or if I'm chilling at my PC, right? But the, the great thing is that it allows me to just ignore a message I don't want to interface with if I don't want to respond to it right away. Again, yeah, that's probably a bit toxic. I, I would argue it's my toxic trait, definitely. But sometimes I just don't have the energy to, like, reply to a message. I just don't feel like it, right? I'd rather just uh, let it sit. And the good thing about showing offline is people don't expect you to respond immediately. If I was online or, like, any status of online, people would expect me to respond immediately. And because I'm not... Well, they aren't. So that's great. It's 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 a wonderful thing. Not only does it save me time from not having to go through social interactions that I might not want to go through because I 
don't want to waste my time chatting with people. I'd rather be working or doing anything else while I'm at my PC. But I also don't have to worry. You know, like, I don't have to worry about being an asshole because I don't feel like responding right away, which I think is great. It's a, it's a bit of a toxic trait. I, I, won't, I won't deny that, absolutely. But I do genuinely sometimes just go out of my way to, like, just, you know, push a push replying to some message down the line. But I, I, I can't be the only one, because it's, like, such a common thing where people talk about, like, oh, I, I've been dreading writing this email to my professor at uni for, like, the past week or something like that. Like, I feel like I'm not the only one that does that, right? Some people would call it social anxiety. I don't think I have social anxiety. I just, like, don't want to do social stuff. Yo, host that's great. Sinus would have also been nice. What I mean to say is basically, like, even if somebody sends me a Discord message, know that I mostly treat that shit like a, like an email. So I might not respond immediately. That's just that's just how it is. But that's how I treat, like, anything on social media. I think of it, like, almost like the YouTube comments, right? Like, I read all the comments and I reply to some of them, etc, etc. But, like, when you leave a YouTube comment on a video, even if you know the, the YouTuber reads and responds to comments, you don't expect them to respond immediately. Even if the video just went up, you don't necessarily uh, expect that they will respond immediately. They've got other things to do as well. Uh, in, in my case, the videos are all scheduled to go up automatically. There's a good chance that I won't necessarily be checking my channel page exactly when a video goes live, right? That's just, I'm, I'm, I got other things to do. I hate those guys so much, dude. I got hit like 18 times on this floor already, by the way, but thank God I got so much HP, right? That's how, I, that's how I treat chat messages. I, uh, I treat them like an email, kind of. Or like a, like a comment left on something. Where I'm like, yeah, I'll, I'll respond to this when I feel like it. I'll respond to this when I'm in the headspace. I feel like more people should treat it like that way. Because, like, the, the, the messed up thing really is the expectation that has been created by the vapid spread of the internet that everybody is always online and thus is always going to be responsible. Uh, or it's always going to be responsive immediately, right? That's a stupid expectation. And it's not real. It does not reflect reality. That's that's dumb. Like, yeah, if, it, if, the, if the medium you're conversing between or through shows that people have read your message and then they still didn't respond, that's messed up to an extent. That means you can tell they're actively ignoring you. But at the very least, you know, if it doesn't have that, then you shouldn't worry about it too much if you don't get an immediate response. I'm sure I can't be the only one. There's probably people that go out of their way to, like, s like read the notification tab for, like, a text message they got. This is kind of too, there's no point in taking this. But then, like, you know, not actually opening the app so it doesn't mark the message as read, so the other person doesn't know you've read it. I've done that. I, I've done that before. <laughs> there, there are tricks. There are tricks for us uh, anti-social whites who, who you know, don't want to necessarily interface with uh, social stuff immediately. But I just like, yeah, I just, I'm just not a, not a huge fan of the idea of being always able to respond instantly, being always at the the fingertips, at the behest of others. I guess we're done with this floor. I can't buy anything. I don't have a roll ready for my potential angel deal, which sucks. But I did that that one to myself. I, I got no excuses. That one's just all on me. Anyway, let's go down today, baby. No deal. That's fine. Down we go. It's that easy. Like, I'm genuinely curious. If you ever message somebody, wherever it be, be it on Discord, be it on another social media, be it on Steam, do you expect them to respond immediately? I guess if they're online, you do, right? That's that's what being online means. Like, the only place I ever show is online is Steam, but for some reason, people don't message me on Steam. I got, like, two or three people that I regularly, like, semi-regularly chat with on Steam, and I don't mind chatting with them because they're my friends. They, they're, you know, close friends of mine, so I don't mind it too much. And usually it's initiated by them, so that's... I guess that's a bonus as well, to an extent. But, like, on Discord, I... <clears throat> don't think I'll ever show us online in my life ever again. Not just because I don't want people not messaging me. I mean, I mo mostly only add people I already know anyway. So, like, and my DMs are closed, so it's not like randoms would be messaging me. Even then, like, I don't want, like, people seeing that in the service. I mean, I don't want people seeing... I don't... Basically, this is just a bit... Basically, I do not wish to be perceived online. I, I don't wish to be perceived. I do not wish to be in people's minds. When you're watching my, my Isaac videos, I wish to be in your mind for as long as you are sitting there, enjoying the video, enjoying whatever I'm talking about. And then once you're done watching the video, you go on with your day, you don't think about me anymore until 24 hours later when the next video drops. That's, that's, all, I, that's all I want. You don't have to do anything else like that. I appreciate anything you do beyond that, but just let it be known, I do not wish to be perceived in any other way. It, it sounds a bit rude, I'm really not trying to make it sound that way, believe me. I do not mean it in any form of rude intentions or whatsoever. I just kind of enjoy solitude. I just enjoy being by myself. I just, I just enjoy chilling. Being chilling, you could even say. Again, as I said, it's kind of like a toxic trait. 
It's my red flag or whatever you want you want to call it. <laughs> Just enjoy my melancholic solitude. So please let me let me revel in that. Oh, I can redo the floor. Oh, well, of all the floors to redo, this one. I guess we'll see. Maybe I can get a- Yeah, if I don't get an angel deal and stuff, that could actually be good, now that I think about it. I mean, I am guaranteed a deal on this floor no matter what, it's just, you know, it's a matter of which one is it. Let's kill mo uh, mom's heart real quick. It shouldn't be that hard. I'm very much surprised I haven't lost my deal chances, and there's my angel deal! Eh, it's flight, I should take it. Oh, little clock. We're getting the entire army of, like, trinket buddies together. <laughs> Hell yeah! Alright, uh... Yeah, let's just... Redo the floor. Might as well. We got the whole trinket buddy army, man. Wait, did my lost soul? No. Why do I have two blood clots? Did the one from last floor stay or something? What? Trinket army. That's that's the that's the theme of this run, apparently. Oh, you know what's happening? One of the blood clots is mine, and one of them is found souls. Found soul has his own blood clot. That's weird as hell, but also kind of crazy good. That's a that's a soft synergy that I never thought about, but that makes perfect sense. That's really cool, actually. Okay, well, I guess we're just done with this. Down we go. Whoa. The beam whipping around just, like, kind of sends him flying. That's cool. It has to be, like, right here. Yeah. What? Okay, uh, hold up. Yeah, sure, I want to grab this. Uh, what do I even get? It's a bit late for a glitch crown. It's not going to do much at this point. Neither would... Sacred orb, because it's just like one floor left, right? It's 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 not likely to be doing much for me. So, you know what? I'll I'll take funny rock. I'll take rock bottom. There it is. All right, frick yeah, baby, steak baby, Sunday baby. Oh, there goes lost soul. I mean found soul. Same thing really. That just like halved my damage output basically. Or you're really just making me stronger by hitting me. Honestly, could you hit me again? I got more damage. My game just crashed to desktop. What? Huh? Please, I, I'm gonna have to do the whole damn floor again, aren't I? Oh my god. I have to do the whole damn floor over again? Oh hell no, nah. what the fuck? Why did- why did my game crash? That was weird. Yep, you know what? Fuck it, we're taking Glitch Crown this time. <laughs> maybe, maybe I just shouldn't be taking- maybe I just shouldn't be taking, uh, rock. Clearly, that's the problem. Uh, please don't crash? Okay, it didn't crash. It spawned the Void Portal again, which is funny. Uh, maybe that's what crashed it last time, for some reason. The Void just showing up, you know? There's homing, that's cool. There's Jacob's Ladder. Damocles is a bit late. 2020, okay, yeah, we got some- we got some crazy shit in here, alright. There's homing, huge. I want 2020, although I wouldn't mind cancer. I guess if I mess up, I get cancer, which is also... Uh, not in real life, obviously, but like, it's not that bad here. Whoa! This leveled up severely thanks to those few item pickups. Oh, baby. Luck up tears down. Actually, totally fine. My tier rate is crazy. What the heck is going on? I'm joined. Ah, oh, fuck. I got pop. At least pop isn't that bad with tractor beam, I guess, because they, they will keep moving anyway. What the hell? Why did they end up in the opposite corner of the room? What was that? Is my game, like, broken? Is my game cursed? Did some- like, did somebody put a hex on me? That doesn't seem right. Compound fracture. <laughs> Compound fracture. Absolutely. Oh boy. <laughs> We're gonna get into actual game crash poten uh, potentially. A matter of fact, just to be safe, because I don't want to lose another 10 minutes of my life. Um, yeah, this is kind of crazy now with all the eyes just bouncing around and the splitting. Oh, you're gonna give me another item? Ah. Uh... I'm going to save before I grab Hemolacria, because <laughs> I feel like Hemo is going to crash my game. And in we go, Mega Satan time, baby. He's he's in for he's in for a treat here. He doesn't know what's hitting him, man. Whoa, that's a lot of like just laser beams and tear effects and a lot of stuff going on. Yeah, I'm I'm doing quite a lot of damage. I I would say I'm doing a lot more damage than I was expecting. Uh, a lot of spiders are spawning. Pretty good. There you go, phase one down. Just like that. What a way to put a long night to rest, huh? Honestly, if there's a void, I'm not doing it. I'm sorry. It's been too long of a day. I've had too many bad lost runs. It's taking a bit to eat through his face too, but at the same time, who cares, really? You hit me and just made me a bit stronger. Actually, I lost damage because I lost the purity aura. I, you know how I said I wouldn't do the void? I lied. I was just hoping that me saying that would make it so the void portal didn't spawn, so I didn't have to think about it. Ah, uh, Monstro's Lung. <laughs> no. But I can't resist. I definitely shouldn't have. <laughs> there he is. Yeah, I think I severely hampered my uh, DPS by taking Monstro's Lung. But at the same time, I guess it means that this fight gets to last a tad longer than normally. 
I'm like not sweating at it whatsoever, so this is fine. I'm still doing enormous amounts of damage to him. There is so many tears on the screen, it's impossible to avoid them. He's dead, he's as good as dead. It's it's so over, dude. Just die. Thank you. Yeah, I shouldn't have taken Monstros, but I didn't know if the synergy was gonna be good. Oh, it's over, dude. Finally. After such a long night. <laughs>